Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 64. We are doing things in Hideout Hell. Or Hideout Hell without the M, because the, the, that's basically what this level is. I'm sorry if I'm, you know, being redundant and saying this over and over again, but you kind of get what I'm, where I'm going and what I'm going in the end. By the way, oh yeah, this one is just find the right box and hit the enemy. But of course, it, there's like four boxes. Oh, oh yeah, it's 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 fairly easy. It's like usually the second or third one you find, you can it, it's in there. So yeah, once it, it once it, that timer on the bottom hits the 30 minute mark. Yeah, it's gonna be something, and, and, and whatever. Uh, well, well, I don't even care right now. Oh, right, it's this one. This one is not so hard as one of them, but, I mean, it, 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 it can be pretty hard. I mean, if you're not the best at aiming, and you're just, you know, spamming projectiles like I am, like, well, I guess an idiot, then, yeah, you'll probably fail. Like... Like that. It's, it's, it's like... It's like if only there were like five minutes added to the timers. So yeah, with this thing you just gotta use the um, zoom in mode thing, you know, whatever it's called, the uh, sniper mode. Uh, hit as many crumblings as you can. Just like you need so many and it isn't funny. Uh -huh. Well done! Of course it's well done, because, I mean, seriously, it it is, like, freaking evil. Yeah, and, and usually, yeah, as I told you, there's going to be a banana coin. Wherever those things turn off, you can actually get a banana coin where the um, laser thing is. So now, next is the thing for Tiny, and here's a stupid claptrap that, you know, won't get out of this world. And there's a part of a grate that I just punched away in the last part, and it's in my way. <laughs> Freaking game laughs at you. Isn't that wonderful? The game, the video game, laughs at you. I mean, okay, maybe not the game, maybe it just has, well, yeah, kind of. Maybe it's K. Rule. I have no idea what it's laughing at. But, you know, y you get the point. Something is laughing, and it's evil, and you want to freaking kill it. Whatever. <laughs> my throat hurts. My brain hurts, and my gaming skill hurts. Well, actually, maybe it doesn't hurt, but it, it's... Okay, there are two of these kind of float-in-the-air mini-games. You know, like, she can float in the air and, t and uh, climb up trees. And they're absolutely fantastic with the horrible camera positioning. I mean, seriously. The best camera ever. The award for best camera ever, or best camera thing ever in a game, goes to Donkey Kong 64. On the way, it's an actually crappy thing. Now, it's time for the one that I usually fail at. You hit the floor and you fail. So basically, you just go across these, and you touch the floor, and it's bad luck! Because the game just, I mean, it, it, it wouldn't be fun if it wasn't, you know, freaking evil like it is here, wouldn't it? Huh? No, it would not. It wouldn't be fun, would it? Because, I mean, all hard games are fun, aren't they? Uh, yes, th th it's, it's like there's certain games, th that's what I like about the Wii nowadays, like, people say that Wii games are, aren't hardly, you know, hard enough, but I mean, there, there are those casual gamers that play like Wii Sports or something, you know, those casual gamers, they can actually beat Wii games, 
But when it comes to like games like this, you know, the Nintendo 64, and especially the NES and SNES eras, it, it you know, the casual gamer wouldn't be able to beat those. I'm sorry, but it, 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 it would just be impossible for an everyday casual gamer to beat a certain a game like this, or freaking Battle Toads or, or whatever. I think I already mentioned Battle Toads. Do I care? No. I probably mentioned Battle Toads in a pre recording, which I probably won't be posting. I might be posting. I probably won't be posting because, well, I. I'm. 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 Bleh. Bleh. This might just be. Oh, no, this is. I actually did this in a pre recording. Once you know how to do it, it's fairly easy. You just uh, avoid these douchebags. Go, yeah, go that way. Go this way. Hit the switch. Run like the lanky person you are. Try to go through without hitting walls, and get to the goal after hitting the switch. So that is it with that mini game. And now it is time for the most evil mini game. As you can see, I did not get that banana medal because I did not beat this mini game because it is the epitome of freaking evil. It may take me the rest of this part to even you know fail a few times at this one because it is that evil. I mean, sure, I hit one of these, but believe me, there's going to be more, and they are freaking hell to hit. I mean, that one, I, I thought it was going to go overhead, and did not. I mean, you know, th this game can be such an evil little bastard. These bee things, uh, whatever the hell they're called, they're the most impossible things to hit with, like, ranged weaponry. You would, you would not believe. Like, usually, when you shoot them, and you try to hit them, just try, and I mean like try seriously, try to hit them. Their, their freaking blades will just, it will hit the blades on them, and it will miss, and it will fail, and you'll you'll probably cry if you've been trying this for hours like I have. Oh gee whiz, I failed again. Of course I would fail again, this freaking mini game. I mean, like, it demands you to be extremely fast with these freaking things, which are freaking evil. Did I mention they are freaking evil? Yes, I did mention that they are freaking evil. I mean, look at that. Look at that. I didn't... I, I could, it's, it's, it's almost impossible to hit these bastards. Man, this game. Oh god, this game. I know one of these fuckers is gonna go overhead. And I know that I'm gonna miss it. I, I mean, I didn't know I was gonna miss it, but of course I was gonna miss it. I mean, it, it, it's pretty clear. I'm not sure why I did not know that I would miss it, but hey, I mean, you know. Yeah, I think the best tactic here is to watch for them to go overhead, like uh, that one did not, or just pray to God that you can actually hit them. But pray as you might, you will not succeed. You know, this game is that evil. I mean, I in a pre-recording, I wasted like 20 freaking minutes on this goddamn thing and I believe you me it, it is not fun it's like a video game is supposed to be fun right well this is not fun I mean look 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 at how it's so freaking hard to hit these bastards I got 10 seconds left but I probably won't hit any of these guys why because they're freakers Look at that! I, I mean, what the hell? If I only had t ten, ten minutes, I would have been actually able to do this. But no, I mean, the game has to be evil. 
it has to be freaking Battle Toads. You know, like people ask, is this Battle Toads? And you say, no, but this is pretty much as hard as Battle Toads sometimes. You know, it's uh, I'm, I, I've already wasted like half a freaking episode or a part or whatever the hell you want to call this. People call it um, um episodes. I call them parts. I don't freaking care. Well done. Holy crap! I actually did it, and we're running out of time in this part. So okay. saving, I guess. Stopping, I guess.